Welcome back. We've got some more Civilization V coming at you right now. Last time we left off, we were getting ready to fight Utrecht, and that is still... Whoop, nope, sorry. That is still 100% on... We're on board with that. Uh... Ooh, comp... Oh, my God. Uh... Oh, both of these would be really good right now, but so would this. Because I would get to save, like, 33% of my travel costs. Hmm. But you know what? Uh, let's go for the production and great general because the great general bonus is going to be huge. Plus, I need to get as many units as I can right now. That's one of my big priorities. And I'll already get a bonus by having them side by side. I mean, side by side with a great general. Porcelain Tower has been built far, far away. I know, I'm behind in everything. Thanks for the update. Surprise, surprise. Where is Porcelain Tower? Wow, architecture. At least building... Oh, I'm the second most busy person in the world. That's nice. But at least building a... A uh, library in Vladivostok can get us a little bit back on track. I didn't realize I hadn't built one yet. Kind of sad. Alright. Send these guys down here. What in the hell? Why did they send them that way? Whatever. Send them to flank on this side. Oh, William, you sure you don't want in on this? Because it's going to be good. William. William, talk to me. Come on, Netherlands. Netherlands. What's up? Declare war. Harold. Well, sorry, man. Damn. Build me another musket man. Get him super good on a uh, Flat surfaces. Okay, you guys go over here. The final thing to top it off would probably be a trebuchet. Or at least a cannon would be good. But we're still kind of at a disadvantage on that one. Because we need... I'm putting in so much effort trying to research, when really I'm just not at the task of researching right now. Here I was talking about how I don't build military units very well, but I'm trying to do exactly that. I did not mean to do that. Whoops. I'm going to have to send you back down after they hit you and try to repair. Go build a farm, damn it. Okay. A stoneworks gives happiness, so let's do that. This is one crucial ba balancing act that I'm just kind of failing. How are you doing, Groningen? Groningen? William's really making this place pretty neat. Yeah, I figured you're going to hit me. A lot. That was my fault for misclicking. Probably need to send him right here. Yeah, so I'm out of range of the city. Alright, people. This is about to be a battle zone. Send you guys down here. Then once I get a cannon, I think I'll be ready to go. Hopefully. I might need to send these guys down one, both of them, so I can get in range. Oh! 
It looks like William is about to throw down. Nice. But I hope he doesn't do that thing where he waits for me to weaken them. Oh, oh, I was not out of range like I thought I was. Anyway, I hope he doesn't do that thing where he waits for me to weaken everybody and then comes in for the kill. I've had that happen before with allied nations, and you better believe that. It doesn't go so well after that. Damn it. Barbarians. I probably should keep this guy up here to kill him. Or at least monitor, see what they do. Go ahead and just make some wealth for us, Moscow. Because I think you're done building everything else except an armory. I guess, yeah. Build wealth. Uh, you people, move over here, because they weren't able to get you there. And next turn. And the Taj Mahal 2 is done. If I get Utrecht, I should probably just keep it as a uh, puppet state, because it's still going to give me a negative bonus, but at least I'd have cotton, so that's something. Alright, let's go ahead and kill these guys right quick. Nice. Hmm. Go ahead. Take him out. Yep. Boom. Okay. We'll just have you heal up next turn and then send you south. And more culture. Yay, culture. Come on, come on. Jerusalem is bankrupt. Whatever. We're all having troubles, bro. Uh oh, speaking of which, we got more people coming up this way. Send the musket men down, I guess. Moscow, how quickly can you get us a. Cannon. Four turns, I'll take it. And fertilizer would probably be good. Let's do fertilizer, because this way I can do some more growth bonus. Protect all of the workers. Uh, sure. Damn it. Battery's low. Alright. Man, the Sistine Chapel. I made a big mistake not picking Nebuchadnezzar. Is there anything else I need to build, for God's sakes? Maybe an amphitheater? A stable. Let's have you build a cannon too, just in case. Hmm. Let's see. Ooh, I finally have something to actually build for somebody. That's quite rare. Okay. Uh, <coughs> Just get you a little bit of bombar bombardment. Have these guys come in and shoot the shit out of you. Good. Very good. Bam. Still think I won that battle, Mr. Barbarian. Actually, you guys could probably come in and just hit him. Yep. Boop. 
Very good. All right, keep those guys right there. I've still got a unit out here that's just kind of trapped near Tunsberg. I hate that I keep having to spend money, but I love that I'm getting research. I need it really, really badly. Nope. Nothing doing, Harold. Nothing doing. Okay. I think I finally have enough units. Now it's just more about getting them in the right places. Also, once my cannons are done, then I'll have enough units. Uh, Vladivostok needs to build... Krepost. Oh, I have this. Build the mine. And build a farm. After we get a cannon, I might get Moscow to go back to gold. So I can have some money saved up. I really want to go ahead and start the battle during this episode. I need everybody to hurry up. All right, you guys stop short so I can heal you while we're in the same, while we're still in our borders. William's going around the side. That'll be good. You guys not healed yet? Damn. We're just going to storm the fuck out of Utrecht. I could start sending these guys south, but I'm really kind of afraid that that trebuchet is going to be able to hit them in the trees. Alright. Sound like, yep. The cannon is done. Send it down. Send it down. Build some wealth. Which is totally how this works. No. Until I'm getting nervous, you've been a little bit jumpy as of late. By jumpy, I mean you haven't been wanting to play on anybody else's team, and I'm kind of worried about that, if we're being honest. And you've got larger ships than mine on my coast. Uh, sure. I'm cool with you, Babylon, because you're cool with William of the Netherlands. Open borders to Attila. Yeah, we're just going to leave Attila as he is. Sadly. God, I need more happiness. Hmm. Yeah, 27 of it's just by population. And several from the number of cities. Okay. As soon as we get everybody down south, we'll be able to start this baby up. Yes, we're friends. Everybody's friends. We've acknowledged this. Sure, let's work together. I guess. Whatever. <laughs> okay, this cannon's almost done too. These guys are healed. Oh, we are clicking. We are cooking with gas, as they say. Send you down here. Send you guys right... I guess I'm going to send you guys around the side. Move this cannon forward. Probably going to put it right here. Move this cannon forward. I'm going to move it here, but I'm going to move him south. Uh, build an amphitheater. And you guys, stab this Danish horse character thing. Then I'll attack him with a crossbow. Anything we can clear out right now, we should. I think he's probably just trying to plunder William's workers while they're out here. 
Which is not a bad way to go about it. Unmet player, lost of capital. Oh, poor person. I was that person last game. Okay. Alright. You guys, heal. Heal. Switch places. I need our melee units down there, but I also want to get the cannons ready. If I can get the cannon on this hill, and possibly right there, or maybe right here. Oops, sorry, keep doing the fertilizer. Where's the clothes? There we go. Move you guys right here. Hopefully you're not in the range of the trebuchet, but we'll certainly find out, won't we? Either way, next turn, I think we're starting. Build a granary. Ah, there's a blank space of nothing here. Go do something with that. Build a farm. Take a nap. Yes, I'm ordering you to take a nap. Hmm. Alright, we are going to t start this battle before the end of this episode, I swear of it. Oof. I might just make it an extra long episode so we can just go ahead and take Utrecht. Alright, they've got pikemen. We've got pikemen. I can just send those... I can send you two to worry about the pikemen. You fortify yourself. You move to the side. Open fire. You come down. See if you can get set up. Even if you can't hit the city, we're going to still hit uh, the actual pikemen themselves. Yeah, you, there's no way you can definitely hit the city right there. Okay. Come down. Yep, you're in the trees. Come down. You're going to come up here. Everybody's going to move forward. We've got our ranged units up front. Alright, let's try to make this happen, people. Is where heroes are born. No going back. Oh, they can already start firing. Oh, wait. That's right. Uh, we were going to move it here. You go here. Alright. This is the moment of truth. Let's see what happens. I'm so nervous. Let's see. Their trebuchet is going to hurt a little bit, but not near as much. I think I have enough to actually take them out, depending on how much trouble these pikemen give us. Luckily, it seems like they're using... They didn't focus on any of our melee... Wow, I think they're actually worried more about William than they are about me, which is kind of saying something. But I'll accept it, because that means less pressure for me. And I can just sit here and at my leisure take them out. Because they just fled their units. Alright, you guys here. Uh, move up. Get in position. Move for. Oh, that was the wrong move. Okay. Uh, move forward this way. We're going to flank them again. You guys move over here. Pillage. And stay on guard. Build a heroic epic. Or write one, at least. 
and I'm going to send you guys around here. We're just going to circle back. Make sure there's no barbarians. Seems like all is good. If we can build a farm, that'd be nice, but I doubt we can. Yeah, they're more worried about William, and that's going to be their downfall in Utrecht. I'm going to get some cotton. I'm going to get some cotton. And a polder. Or the polder. I don't know. Oh, wow. Congratulations. They're going to take out my pikemen. Is that really worth it? I'm sorry, pikemen. You were so loyal. You fought well. I respect you immensely, but ultimately, it had to happen, in the name of victory. Alright guys, moment of truth, again, open fire, keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming, we've got a lot going on, we can do this, I think we've got it. Alright, now move in for the kill. Wait, what did it say? Attacking cities. Yeah, I know. This is not my first time. It's just You wouldn't know that by watching me play, though. I want to attack you anyway, thank you. There we go. Liberate. Nope, I'm creating a puppet. I need I need some extra stuff. Build a wall. I guess. All right, now it's time we can actually send some workers to the south to do some work. Build construct I mean a uh, trade post. Alright folks, I know this has been a longer episode, but we finally, finally got Utrecht. Uh, we haven't won the war, but we have won the battle. We're about to see what they're going to do in retaliation, then we'll call the episode there. Yep, they're going to go right back after my musket men. But luckily I have enough to keep them on their toes. And I've still got a lot of ranged units that they don't. they still got their tributaries. Cotton. Alright. Come down here. Build a road. And please, William, for God's sake, don't buy my road. I need that. You guys go here. Stay on guard. Move forward. Attack. Nice. All right, you guys move out. Heal. Move in. Move here. Move here. Move here. Heal. Open fire? Yep, we can get them. Perfect. And a great general go to the city, which we are going to name... Ah, uh, what should we name? Uh... What's a good Russian city that I can't think of right now? Hmm. Damn it. Let's see. Gotta come up with a Russian city off the top of my head. Uh, Sevastopol? No, wait, that's uh, in Crimea. Krasnodar? Krasnoyarsk? Irkutsk? Let's do Irkutsk. Irkutsk. I like it. Damn it, I like getting Big Ben. It's one of the better of the the uh, wonders you can build. Especially when you buy as much as I do. No, fuck you. Alright, people, that's the last turn for this episode. Let's just see what they do. Uh, thank you for watching. We finally made something happen in a big way. We took uh, Utrecht, and now we've renamed it Irkutsk. 
We're building a road to get there. We've got cotton. We've got a little bit of good stuff. I mean, not a lot of good stuff, but still, it's a city that we can actually do something with. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Have a good day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!